Stan Gibalisco here to introduce a word you may have never heard before, Gegenschein. Gegenschein, it literally means counterglow. And what you might ask is that. Well, on the largest scale, it's a faint glow that you see in the heavens exactly opposite the sun, especially, well, really just about only on a moonless night far away from the lights of civilization. When your eyes get a chance to adapt to the darkness, you may be able to perceive a faint glow exactly opposite the sun. What's that caused by? It's caused by every cosmic particle, every speck of dust, every little piece of debris that there is out there in outer space. It's not a pure vacuum. But every little rock, every little tiny meteoroid looks like it's in exactly the full phase when it's opposite the sun, just as happens with the moon. You may have noticed a similar effect, counterglow, right around your head in your shadow, in, I should say around the shadow of your head, when you stand on a sunny day over something like a concrete driveway and a somewhat rough, irregular surface, and you look at the shadow of your head as cast by the sun, and you may be able to perceive a faint glow around your head. Again, that's an example of Gegenschein. It's where Every single particle conspires to eliminate the shadows that you would otherwise see and dramatically, in some cases, increase the brightness of the object that you're looking at. That's why, for example, three or four hours before and three or four hours after a lunar eclipse, the full moon appears unnaturally bright. You may think that's an illusion, but it's not. It's actually caused, it's a form of Gegenschein produced when all of the shadows of all of the irregularities on the surface of the moon are erased because they are eclipsed by the object that casts them and you see nothing but light, no shadow at all. You may have also noticed this Gegenschein, as you're flying over, say, uh, open fields in an airplane, and you look for the shadow of the airplane, and you might not be able to see the shadow of the airplane if you're at sufficient altitude, but you will see the location of that shadow as a Gegenschein on the ground. It seems to be moving along, and that is caused, not of, of course, not by the sun being opposite the earth, but by the sun being on a direct line with your head in the center of that glow. Every blade of grass, every little rock has a shadow that you cannot see when it's exactly opposite the sun. Every shadow is eclipsed by the object that casts it and is in full sunlight. Therefore, you see this counterglow. And that's literally what Gegenschein means. Stan Gibalisco signing off. Until next time, so long.